So Allie and I are at Puzzle and it's a little cafe, um, like a little restaurant, cafe, cafe shop. And it's so cool, it's so artsy. Artsy and fun. Thank you. You're very welcome. Ooh. You're always welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Hello. So we just ended lunch at Puzzle. And the thing is, the cool thing is, is that it's actually um, where Autistic people work like the servers, and I don't know if the cooks are. I don't think the cooks are, no. but um, the servers and the waiters and the waitresses are all autistic, and it's just so awesome to see that they have that opportunity to work and um, to make an income and all that. And we're actually inspired by our waiter, Carl, and he. We told him that we were fashion students, former fashion students, and then he gives us a sketch of one of his jackets. So, and it looks like that. You see that? Like, he had so much confidence in giving it to us. He was just like, here, and then maybe you can make it and then sell it in the store that's nearby, or that's next door to us. And we were just so, I guess just inspired. He had so much confidence, but he wasn't arrogant. Um, it was it was just such a great lesson that we didn't expect in getting during our lunch and during our conversation. But it just so happened that we had a life lesson, and now Allie is going to post that in her inspiration board. Tonight we are going to Art and Island with the family and apparently it's Asia's largest 3D museum so it should be fun. Here's the family. Hi! Say hi! into. Wow, it's actually really nice detailing. Okay, yes. Yes. Can I have this painted in my bedroom? Going up, going up, going up.
got his wings. Hellbound. Today is, I don't even know, I don't even know what day it is, Sunday? Today is Friday and um, we currently are going through a journey of generosity conference and I kind of spoke on it during my first vlog and it's basically an event held, not held, but it's by um, the organization Generous Giving and they really stress on the importance of being generous how um, nothing is ours to begin with and that we should be um, using God's blessings and his gifts financially and in other ways um, towards towards his kingdom and started at 8 30 and it ends at 5 so check out this view though what Manila is so pretty look at that skyline actually been a lot of students and a lot of them are younger than me and I'm getting I'm feeling I'm getting to that age where I feel really old even though I know I'm not but yeah so it's going really well so we'll see how the rest unfolds it's now Monday and the seminar went really well learned a lot draining we came home and it was those times where you sleep early and then you still wake up late like that's how drained at least I was so today we are going to the office um, for our last general Thailand meeting. Oh, can't believe it's already the last one. But we still have like 15 days left until we actually leave for Thailand. So let's go. our last general meeting before we head out to Thailand and it's good it was a good meeting still a lot of last-minute detailing and planning going on and it's nice getting to know what's um, going on in each logistical department um, just collaborating and coming together to see what else needs to be done so we're almost there we're almost there um, it was definitely a, a good, fruitful time, and I like how intentional they are on prayer because we'd have like um, an hour and a half of discussion on what we're, uh, what, what is going on program-wise, and then we'd get into pairs um, and just pray, and then we'd go on for another hour and a half talking, and then after that we'd pray. Um, for that specific group and people and those tasks so it was a good meeting for sure a good last meeting now I am going to edit this video and I will talk to you later I hope you have a marvelous day <laughs> 